Well, Merry Christmas Eve. I don't know if you saw the recent announcement on georeference.org, but Manifold is now providing directions on how to get involved in the latest beta for Radiant Studio, otherwise, and also for the release 9 of Manifold GIS. What I wanted to do is give you a little bit of uh, a look at some of the things that I've been doing with Manifold as I've been part of a beta test for the last year. So here I'm going to be bringing in a file with four and a half million records in it. So this is uh, Rhodes in the Northeast United States. It, you can see that it opens instantaneously and when I click on the Rhodes it takes just a couple of seconds to bring all of them in. One of the other things I can do is right click and just zoom to say New York City and you can see how quickly that comes in. Let's get into Manhattan a little bit and again so within seconds we're actually right into the heart of the city and let me zoom back out and when we zoom to the whole thing you can see again the entire data set is presented. What I'm going to show you next is something that I've been doing in QGIS as well looking at the same data. Now I've already loaded it into the project because it takes a little bit of time but if I turn it on you can see what's happening with the drawing speed. It takes substantially longer so in this case Manifold has done a really good job of creating very fast rendering within their display and as you can see we're still in New York so it's taking quite a while to get into uh, showing the entire four and a half million records. Let's zoom into the upstate New York area around Rochester because I didn't want to wait for all the data and we can zoom in a little further toward Rochester again. So these are the kinds of speeds that we're seeing using QGIS and the next thing I'll do is zoom all the way out and we'll give it a second to sort of get wake up and here it comes so you can see the entire state is being drawn again going back to manifold in, or in radiant engine let me just select the Rochester area and within just a couple of seconds it displays the entire city And here back in QGIS, let's zoom in again on Rochester and then try to do a little bit of panning as well. And again, back in Manifold, it's pretty much instantaneous to move throughout the entire area. Let's zoom back out. So there are some exciting things going on with the new Radian product. Uh, if you're going to be part of the beta, I look forward to talking about it more with you in the months ahead.